my dear friends welcome to rajashekar classes on applied data science with python this is lecture number 492 in this lecture we will try to understand measuring density minimum number of points that is min points and epsilon so as we mentioned in the previous lecture one of the tasks the first task that we have to that we have how do you measure density there are two parameters that that are there in db scan algorithm to measure density the first parameter is called min points the second min points means minimum number of points the second parameter is called epsilon first parameter this one is first parameter the second parameter is epsilon yes these two are called hyper parameters actually this uh, what is this this actually we as this one min points and epsilon this is first one this is second one what is what are they they are called as hyper parameters of your db scan algorithm isn't it the um, uh, hyper parameters of your db scan which defines how db scan works these two parameters min points and epsilon are useful to understand the working of db scan algorithm let me tell you what these points means actually so the first concept we understood is the concept of um, concept of density at a point what is the concept of a density at a point first we will try to understand uh, density at a point given a point p how do you define its density density at p point p is defined as the number of points defined as number of points within a radius within a hypersphere of radius epsilon around p so let me give an example so that so that it will be much more clearer it, it will be much more clearer for you imagine imagine this uh, this point as p yes this point let me assume let me assume this point this point is p which point let me yes let me assume this is point p isn't it i am assuming this point as p and let's assume i am given given epsilon let me say there is an epsilon let's assume epsilon equal to 1 isn't it so given this point p given this point p a hypersphere in 2d into the in a hypersphere in 2d is nothing but circle isn't it what is hypersphere in 2d hypersphere in 2d is a circle in 3d it is a sphere so given a point p let's assume this circle that that can be formed with the radius epsilon radius epsilon means what is the value of epsilon epsilon equal to 1 with radius 1 this is the radius this epsilon equal to 1 is the radius this radius let's say well, epsilon value is 1.1.0 point, point now within this radius let's assume there are three points let me assume there are three points within radius 1 isn't it then the density at this point p is said to be 4 then what is the density density is said to be 4 density equal to 4 because starting from this point starting from this point starting from this point starting from this point in this region or in a sphere in a sphere or a circle circle in 2d with radius of 1.0 with radius of 1.0 how many total number of points are there total number of points the total num total uh, there are total of four points including point p itself so the density at point p is the total number of points within a hypersphere of radius epsilon around the point p within the radius of epsilon around point p so epsilon is the hyperparameter that you have to give the second important concept is what is called dense region a circle or sphere or hypersphere of radius epsilon that contains at least minimum number of points that is min points 
min points number of points let's assume you have min points is uh, let's assume you have min points assume min points is 4 and let's assume epsilon equal to 1.0 these two are called these two are hyperparameters so now what happens is given a point p here given a point p here you draw a circle of radius 1 isn't it you draw a circle of radius 1 we have we have these how many points we have five points just check it out how many points you have here uh, one two three four five points isn't it we have five points hence this region is said to be dense region as we have five points you can say it's a dense region similar uh, similarly let's assume i have point q let's assume i have point I have point Q here within uh, with only two points. Let me say I have only two points in a radius of circle 1.0. The, the number of points is 3. Here how many number of points are there? There are 3 points. 3 is less than min points, isn't it? 3 is less than min points. Here, here in this case what happens? This 5 is, this 5 is greater than min points. Isn't it? That's why this region is dense region. Here your 3 is less than min points. Hence this region is said to be sparse region. This is how we define dense region and sparse regions using these two hyperparameters min points and epsilon. Min points is the minimum number of points that you need to have within an epsilon radius. Just go through this lecture if you have any difficulty please keep a comment in my next lecture that is lecture number 493 in lecture number 493 we will try to understand about core point border point and noise point thank you very much